Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm Sigourney Rosadio, where I encourage individuals to boss up in their business, boss up in their self-love, and you already know, baby, we got to boss up in our faith. Today's video is going to be a business queendom book launch video. I'm going to tell y'all the truth. I got some explaining to do, and hopefully you understand it. Don't judge me. <laughs> so let's just go ahead and hop into this video. All right, y'all. So Queendom is my book that is scheduled to be released January 28th, which is my birthday. I'm super excited about it, but I have been having struggles. I've been having struggles, and I kind of mentioned it in a previous video, but every single time I feel pushback, I go harder because I know that this is only a result of God is going to use this book for him to get the glory. As far as the cover, let's just go through it real quick and let me just explain to y'all the meaning or the reasoning behind the cover and how the cover is going to look. So I'm on my iPad if you did not know and I'm going to show you the book cover. Y'all ready? Is y'all ready? Are y'all ready? <laughs> All right, here is the book cover y'all. Wow, you see me, you see me. <laughs> that is the book cover. Wow, to see it in like, I don't know y'all, it's just so overwhelming to see, to see me. And I wasn't even going to put my face on the cover. Let's just be honest. I'm going to be honest and transparent. I was not going to put my face on the cover because I feel vulnerable like I'm in this crazy weird stage in my brand to where I'm like how much do I want to share and how much do I want to keep to myself and I'm already a super private person I I kind of pick and choose what I share online and having my face on the cover of my book of course it'll be a physical copy but this is just a proof of it having my face on the cover makes me extremely vulnerable and it makes me feel just kind of naked to the world I don't know it's in my mind I don't know what it is but the reason why I put my face on the cover is because I watched Patrice Washington talk about in one of her podcasts about how she was like I put my face on everything if you get a sticker you're gonna see my face on it and she basically talked about the importance of representation we as minorities we have to have representation for us to really and truly feel like it's possible for us and even though my face is on the cover, it's not about me. It's not about anything of me. It's about the next woman knowing that she can be an author. It's about the young girl who may pick up my book 20 years from now knowing that she's a queen. And that's the reason why I'm kind of making myself uncomfortable so that other queens down the line can know that they are boss, to know that they are beautiful, to know that they can do anything that Christ told them that they can do. I also want my daughters, my future daughters one day to just look at this and just know that mama was a queen and so are they and so that's the reason for the book cover again um, I'm going to order a proof and I'm going to kind of explain it further but that is the book cover Queendom the ultimate guide of self-love by Sigourney Elise Rosario and so I'm super excited for the book it came out so good and my eyebrows were symmetrical like yeah give it up for the eyebrows y'all because I was praying on them eyebrows I was like Lord make them symmetrical and it's just it's so natural it's so beautiful it's just so elegant it's so classy and that's how I wanted the the book cover to portray the crown is shiny I mean it's just giving what it's supposed to give y'all do y'all see it Oh, it's the face, it's the natural hair for me, it is the dress for me, it's the nails, it's everything. It's just beautiful. So, that's good. The book cover is done. Um, the interior design is good too. We finally got that done. Ooh, I'm super excited. So, the next step for me is ordering the proof. So, when I order the proof, I'm going to examine the book from the front cover all the way to the back cover. I'm going to check for everything, make sure everything is good, make sure the layout is good, make sure the pictures are good. Again, this book will be a lot more interactive. It will include journal prompts. It will include places for you to write. It will include devotionals. It will include how to boss up in your self-love journey in all areas and all pillars of life. Um, and it's just me pouring my heart out to every single woman who picks up the book to know that she is a boss, that she's a queen, that she is loved, that she is beautiful, that she is smart, that she can do anything she want to do. And so I'm super excited to share the book with you. The next thing I want to talk about when it comes down to queendom is the packaging. So 
If you followed me on my first book journey, you know that I offer people autographed copies of the book. This is something I want to continue on with every book because I realize people want that personal touch and I like packaging stuff. I know a lot of people don't like packaging, but I personally like packaging. Um, and I'm starting to kind of think of the layout of how I want to package Queendom. It needs to feel rich, you know, I need it to be rich vibe, rich auntie vibes. <laughs> when I package this book and so I know I want to go with a gold black white theme so I'm thinking of maybe a black poly mailer with um a thank you card um I also want to do like my business card to match my website I also y'all know I love to write letters so I will be writing every single person who wants an autographed copy a personalized letter and then I also want to I want to include something more so I thought of including bookmarks bookmarks are an easy very affordable way of promoting your brand promoting yourself um, and I went on a fiber. Y'all know I love me some fiber and I ordered these bookmarks. So let me show you the bookmark currently and let me know down below what y'all think of them. But these are the bookmarks that I'm going to include. Let me see. There we go. These are the bookmarks that I'm going to include in the orders of the people who order the autograph copies. And so on the front, it's just me having the crown. And then the back is including affirmation. So it says, you are the love you are seeking. You are beautiful. You are called. You are unique. You are loved. You are a queen. Okay, don't we love that? And so that's going to be a free little gift that I give the women who order autographed copies of my book. Again, my face is on here. Y'all, my face is everywhere. My face in... It's on the front cover, it's on the back cover, it's on the bookmarks. It's also throughout the book. And so I'm like, dang, God, like... Why am you putting me out here like this? Because for me personally, I wanted a gift that was kind of behind the scenes. Even though I have like a super bubbly personality, I don't want to be like out there. And God is like, oh no, you're going out there. I'm pushing you out there. And it's like, wait a minute, Jesus. Hold on. I'm not ready. And so like I've been talking to Jesus. I'm like, Jesus is like, why you keep putting me out here? And it's like, it's not about you. Get over yourself. It's not about you. It's about the next woman who's going to see you. And so even though my face is kind of the face of the book um, and it's kind of plastered everywhere, it's not even about me. It's about women of color, minority women, knowing that they are beautiful and knowing that they can accomplish things. And so I have to kind of get out my own head, get out my own insecurities and just be like, you know what? you you're going to do this you're going to put yourself out there and one of the things that i decided to do was include a bookmark for the people who sign up for the autograph copy so that they can just get a personal touch it's also an amazing branding tool um super affordable and i just like the idea of giving away free stuff especially when people shop with you when people are spending their heart on coins you know in your business just to give away something for free so that'll be my free gift and i also am thinking about like on the thank you cards, offering um, a discount code for the course. If you've been watching my video, you know a course will also be released in January too, a self-love course. And I was thinking about giving like 20% off the course if you order the autographed copy. Just again, something to give back to others. And I think they will really appreciate that. So that's kind of still in the works. But yes, so the packaging will be black, it'll be gold, it'll be white, it'll be kind of like a rich toned. I kind of want to package it like an envelope maybe and then include the bookmark, include the envelope, include the thank you card. It's kind of all up in here. We still kind of working it through my mind and yeah, I'm super excited for the book. I'm nervous y'all. Like every single time I launch something, it's like nervousness that comes with it. You want it to be good. You want it to be helpful. You want people to find it useful. And I'm just finding myself getting a little anxious about the launch um i also had a photo shoot with african photos so i had a photo shoot where i took pictures in an african scarf this african scarf actually came from africa it is authentically african and i'm about to start launching those pictures i'm about to start launching my marketing strategy i have goals for the book i have aspirations of how i want the book to go putting myself out here is so scary it's like mm, i don't want to do it 
like I'm super nervous but yeah we're gonna do it we're gonna accomplish it and that's just that so the book again will be out January 28th and I'll be offering autographed copies probably two weeks prior to it being launched on Amazon I um, haven't figured out all of that details yet but more information will be coming regarding the autographed copies <sighs> I'm excited y'all I'm excited I'm excited for the course I'm excited for the book I'm excited for just the next year really and truly so many good stuff is coming my way i'm super happy to have y'all on this journey with me for any person who is thinking about starting a business being an author being a podcaster being you know a youtuber <laughs> whatever you are thinking about launching i hope that my story my realness of the ups and downs of the book um me just sharing my insecurities about putting myself out there on the front cover of the book is just an encourager for you hopefully you can see that you know it's not always beautiful it's not always pretty everything isn't always just oh mm, 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 mm. you know there's going to be some ups and downs there's going to be some times to where everything doesn't align but when you let god use you when you get out your own head and when you stop making everything about you that's when you will see the glory of God. I'm not doing this because I necessarily want to. I, I enjoy encouraging people. I enjoy helping people. But I would much rather do it kind of behind the scenes and not be the front cover of the book. But God told me to do it. I feel encouraged. I feel empowered to do it. And I have to get over myself. So just like I have to get over myself, you will have to get over yourself. And we're going to just boss up in our life. We're going to put ourselves out there. We're going to start launching stuff. And hopefully my testimony will help you to launch whatever you want to launch. The world is yours. There is free money out there. Your gift needs to be used. You know what I mean? And it's not even necessarily about the money. It's about the impact. It's about the impact of your gift. And the longer you wait, and the longer you prolong your purpose, and the longer you know you sit here and make it about you, lives, lives are sitting here being wasted because they need to hear your voice. They need to hear what you have to say. They need to hear your, your podcast. They need to read your book. They need to listen to your YouTube. And the longer you wait and the longer you make it about you, they, their life is being wasted because they need to hear your voice. Everybody has a voice that inspires them. Everybody has a voice that touches their heart. My voice may not touch their heart, but your voice may. And so that is the reason why we have to get over ourselves. Do it scared. Do it when you feel like you're not adequate. Do it when you feel like you're not good enough and watch God bless it. You need encouragement? Are you know somebody else who may need encouragement? Please write into my foundation, Let Us Feel Life, where I encourage individuals by writing handwritten letters of encouragement. As always, I love you, but most importantly though, God loves you. I will see y'all in my next video. Bye!